Hi guys, my name is Aman Anu Jindal. Welcome to Morning Tales for August 7, 2019. For all those who are coming here for the first time and watching this video for the first time, uh, do remember to take these quizzes uh, which have been launched on the website on a daily basis. So you can just go to the website. There is a quizzes section that you can see here, and when you click on it, you will be taken to all the quizzes. Let me just show you how it works. So these are all the quiz quizzes that you can see here, which have been lined up for you. you can take these quizzes live and get your scores as well so let us take the quiz for today that is august 7th 2019 okay uh, the first question for today is which is the top retailer company of india in 2018 according to top 100 retailers in asia 2019 report now a lot of you might be thinking that amazon is the biggest retailer in india but that is not so walmart has uh, emerged as the top retailer in india not asia india in the year 2019 uh, 2018 in fact the report is for 2019 uh, because it acquired uh, flipkart last year and that is why uh, walmart has emerged as the top retailer in india now uh, after that we have the top retailer in asia and uh, that award has gone to alibaba so amazon is at number 2 in india alibaba is at number 1 in asia Uh, because of its expansion and growth in china and walmart is at number 1 in india so the answer to this question is walmart okay let's go to the second question which country has honored president ramnath kovind with the national order of merit i think a very important question very high chances of the mous being signed being asked in the examination so instead of just discussing this question i am also going to discuss what are the important points in the mous that have been signed with three countries that president ramnath kovind has visited so number one it has uh, he has received national order of merit from guinea which is uh, the highest civilian honor of guinea okay number two guinea benin and gambia these three countries have been visited by president ramnath kovind and all these three are western pacific western african nations so they lie on the western coast of the continent of africa number 2 so you have to check out all these three nations in the map of africa as well okay that would be your homework and uh, number 3 number 3 we have the mou signed with these three countries let me uh, summarize them for you ev eweb program has has been an mou for evbab evab network project has been signed with the uh, benin now what is this vbab the full form of evab is e e vidya bharti and e arogya bharti vidya bharti arogya bharti okay so that is an important mou that has been signed i think it can be asked in the examination because mous have been asked in the examination uh, consistently in the past as well next we have some uh, mous with gambia now the biggest one is a line of credit has been provided for 92 million okay uh, for skill development we provided 5 lakh dollars and bilateral trade has crossed 200 million dollars in 2018 19 okay that is the that, that is uh, all that we have with gambia next we have guinea guinea we again have evbab uh, network project with guinea okay and he has been provided with national order of merit with kenya okay uh, there is an lc line of credit worth uh, 170 million with kenya as well so 170 million kenya and uh, 92 million with gambia okay so these are the important ones so which country has awarded national order of merit to ramnath kovind the answer to this specific question is kenya okay let's move to the next question with which country has united kingdom formed international or joint international maritime security mission for protection of ship vessels in the strait of hormuz the fir first thing that i want to tell you here and that you need to know is where exactly is this strait of hormuz let me draw it for you very briefly so so that you have a very brief yet clear idea okay so this is the western coast of india let's say india is like this you would be aware about that this is the western coast of india then we have gujarat here 
and then it stretches and goes into Pakistan okay and then you have something developed like this okay okay beautiful okay now it's coming together so this is India this is the western coast of India this is the Arabian Sea and we have one entry here we have Pakistan here we have Afghanistan here at the top and we have Iran here okay now this that you can see here this particular entry that you can see here is the Strait of Hormuz then you go down you have Oman here you have Yemen here and then there is another entry this is Africa now at the bottom this is Africa and then you have another entry here and this is what this is Gulf of Aden okay so this particular point is the Strait of Hormuz and why has it become hot because uh, Iran and uh, United States have been fighting for some time a cold war kind of a thing uh, you all must be aware about that I don't need to discuss it a long story uh, cut short Iran is uh, uh, because Iran ha has borders here so it, it is securing this area and Strait of Hormuz is a very uh, strategic location for movement of vessels oil vessels from Africa and from Middle East to uh, nations around the world and because Iran has control over this or Iran apparently can gain control over this therefore the US is also increasing its military presence here and now UK has joined US in this mission and increasing their military presence there okay who is the new prime minister of United Kingdom please google it if you don't know and uh, if you know it provide it to me in the comment section below I want to know who is the current prime minister of uh, or the latest prime minister of UK who has been selected very recently or elected apparently very recently so USA and uh, UK have come together with this next question I think uh, now you know where Strait of Hormuz is what is India's rank in the World Resources Institute's Aqueduct Water Risk Atlas now this water risk atlas has come out and it's uh, very horrifying out of 16 nations which have been put in the uh, you know uh, high risk extremely high risk category as per uh, aqueduct extremely high risk category India lies at 13th rank so total of uh, more than 190 countries have been analyzed by this uh, uh, institute out of which 16 nations have been put in extremely high risk category and out of this India lies at 13 so you can see and f understand how uh, you know dangerous in a situation are we at, at this point of time okay uh, it also says that almost 25 percent of world's population lives in six, 17 countries facing extremely high stress uh, high water stress and we are very close to zero we are very close to day zero wherein there will be no water left at all for anybody in the entire country okay uh, by that uh, they mean the portable water so 13th is the answer to this question who has won the women's British Open LPGA tournament I want you to answer two things in this question number one uh, who has won the tournament British Open LPGA tournament and number two what is the full form of LPGA and which sport is LPGA connected with uh, so please answer your answer this question these two questions in the comment section below and uh, we will be taking probably this question again tomorrow or if not I will be answering you back in the comment section itself where is Barbi Dam located now this Barbi Dam is in news because uh, it has overflown it is in Maharashtra and it is in Thane district of Maharashtra in uh, Badlapur area and it has overflown due to heavy uh, ra rains in the Maharashtra region and a uh, lot of people about 8500 people have to be evacuated in the low lying areas of Thane so that's why it has been in news that's why it becomes important so the answer is Maharashtra which of the following country is not a member of ASEAN a static question that you should be aware about uh, China is not a member of ASEAN a little bit about ASEAN ASEAN ha has a total of 10 states and two observers China is not a state uh, member state of ASEAN who is the secretary general Jim Lok Hui Jim Lok Hui is the secretary general of ASEAN 
when was it established i think that's very interesting can be asked in the examination it was established through bangkok declaration in the year 1967 okay 1967 bangkok declaration asean was created and uh, apparently india was offered membership of asia asean but it refused and now india wants to be a member but it is still not a member the full form of asean please so please uh, provide it to me in the comment section below so the answer to this question is d china where is tadoba andhari national park now tadoba andhari are two things tadoba is a national park and andhari is a wildlife sanctuary again it is on the eastern coast of maharashtra on the eastern borders of maharashtra not the coast borders of maharashtra so the answer to this question is maharashtra and it has tiger reserves as well which means uh, it is a tiger reserve which means it has tiger population how many countries are members of ibrd international bank for reconstruction and development a very important question some additional information about ibrd ibrd was created after the bretton woods conference in 1944 uh, it was created in 1944 itself with the purpose of development uh, of the regions which were affected by the world war the second world war it has headquarters in washington dc in the united states a total of 189 members uh, and who is the president of world bank right now david malpass president of world bank david malpass okay and ibrd is one of the five member institutions that encompass the world bank group and ibrd is also called as the world bank nowadays so the answer to this question is 189 when was world bank established that's something that i just discussed both ibrd world bank the same thing world bank group total of five member institutions constitute world bank group uh total of uh, uh, how many members 189 when was it established 1944 through what what through uh, bretton woods conference bretton woods conference so the answer to this question is 1944 so we have not answered question 5 and i want you guys to answer that question for me uh, we will meet tomorrow again uh, with a lot of quizzes lot of questions uh, both static and current do share it with your friends do subscribe to the channel and do not forget to press the bell icon if you learn something new and if you like this lesson all the very best take care